Welcome to our quick comparison on Ubuntu versus Fedora. In the next few minutes, we'll examine their key differences and help you decide which one suits you best. Ubuntu uses the Ubiquiti installer guiding you through partitioning updates and third-party codecs in about 10 minutes. Fedora's Anaconda installer is powerful and flexible, but partition management can be slightly more involved. Both installers are graphical and user-friendly, yet Ubuntu's simplicity gives it a slight edge. Both distributions default to GNOME. Ubuntu ships a customized GNOME that echoes its Unity past, while Fedora sticks with the stock GNOME experience. If you prefer alternatives, Ubuntu offers official flavors like Kubuntu and Jubuntu, maintained by separate teams. Fedora spins provide different desktops, all managed by the core Fedora project. Ubuntu relies on APT and Debian's vast repositories plus convenient dev packages. Fedora uses DNF with strictly open source RPMs. Most vendors supply both Deb and RPM, but Deb only releases can occasionally appear. Both face challenges with certain Wi Fi chips and NVIDIA graphics. Ubuntu offers an easy proprietary driver installer, improving compatibility. Fedora prioritizes open source drivers, making proprietary installs more manual and sometimes less stable. Ubuntu's larger user base fuels extensive documentation, forums, and tutorials. Fedora's community is enthusiastic and well-organized on Ask Fedora, but resources are fewer in comparison. Fedora releases every six months, each version supported for 13 months. Ubuntu also offers biannual releases, plus a long-term support LTS edition every two years with five years of updates. Canonical backs Ubuntu, while Red Hat supports Fedora as an upstream for Arhel. Both distributions have strong points. Ubuntu excels in ease of use, driver support, and a massive community, while Fedora delivers the latest open source technologies and aligns closely with Enterprise Arhel. Ubuntu might have a slight edge in user-friendliness and out-of-the-box hardware support, but I personally prefer Fedora.